What's up guys, welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, it's been a couple months since the last account giveaway we did on the channel, and a lot of people have been asking for another one, so here you go. Today we've got a brand new account to give away, courtesy of an amazing subscriber of the channel whose name is Maskan. He basically hit me up a couple weeks ago and told me that uh, he no longer enjoys the game, he's going to be quitting, but he wants to make sure that his account goes to someone that can still appreciate it, can still have a lot of fun with it, so that is exactly what we are going to try to do for him with this video today. Uh, we're basically looking for a new home for this amazing, amazing account. And if you guys are interested in entering the contest and potentially winning it for yourself, then make sure to keep watching. Now before we get into the contest details, we're going to start by taking a look at the account contents, you know, the units, the items, and all that good stuff. So we're going to pop over to the character list here. And as you can see, before I even scroll down, you can probably already tell that this is a very, very good account. I would say it's definitely a whale account, if you will. I mean, I don't know exactly how much money was invested into this account, but just based on you know, how many LRs there are, how many of them are either rainbowed or have multiple dupes. Uh, it was probably pretty significant. And when he first told me that he wanted to give it away and he told me what the account had, I was like, are you, are you sure? Because like, you can probably fetch a pretty decent price on the Dokkan markets out there, right? Like on the internet, you know, like Epic NPC or Facebook or something like that. So I basically gave him about a month, month and a half to think about it and potentially reconsider. And he was 100% sure about it. So now this account will go to one of you guys watching this video. And uh, yeah, enough talking from me. Let's just take a look here. Uh, I think he actually set up a few tags to make this easier. So we'll turn those on. And I think the first tag is for the summonable LRs. And as you can see, in total, there are 29 summonable LRs on this account. Most of them, or at least many of them, have dupes. And a few of them are also rainbowed. For example, AGL LR Gohan at 100%, LR Majin Majida 100%, LR Cell rainbowed. And he also has, I believe, a couple dupes in the STR Gogeta. There we go, 79% STR Gogeta. Uh, I think 69% Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, 3 dupes in the LR Bojack, um, what else, 1 dupe in the Super Saiyan Trunks, and so on and so forth. You know, you guys get the point. I'm not going to go over every single unit, but the point I'm trying to make here is that he's pulled a lot of LRs in his time, and uh, this is just a very, very impressive account, man. Um, I think he's missing probably like three or four summonable LRs on global. Uh, LR Jiren isn't here. Um, I don't think he has STR Broly either, which is very interesting considering how long Broly's been out for, right? But maybe he just didn't get lucky. And uh, what else do we not have? Um, I can't think of anything. I mean, he does have LR Turles. He does have STR Vegito, uh, Fizz, Wu-Tanks, the three-year anniversary LRs. Uh, Tech LR Broly, Rose, uh, Go Bros, and uh, so on and so forth. Now for this other tab, we have the free to play LRs. And obviously he spent a lot of time on this game because of course each free to play LR, especially the prime battle ones, take a lot of time to complete. And it looks like he has every prime battle LR done, even the Extreme Z Awakenings for the first form Frieza and also the Super Saiyan Goku. So mad respect for that. And uh, yeah, I'm not really sure which free to play LRs are missing, if any, but uh, it looks like he has most of them right there. And also, most of them are rainbow too, with a few exceptions. So uh, yeah, just such a great account, man. Like, I'm still, I still kind of want to hit him up and be like, are you really sure you want to do this? Because I feel kind of bad, but I know he's 100% sure because I've asked him like 100 times. I'm sure he's mad annoyed at me at this point. So uh, yeah, anyways, moving on. These are the Dokkan Fest TURs, and there are 55 of them in total. Most of them are actually rainbowed or at 90%, 79%. Uh, some of them don't have dupes, but for the most part, they all have at least one dupe. And he's probably missing like maybe a couple, but not many. Most of them 
are present. Most of the Dokkan Fest category leads, 120 leads, 70% leads, EZA units, and all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, that pretty much covers all of the important stuff. I'll quickly go back to the full box here and just scroll through it so you guys can see the entire thing. But um, as I said, you know, like you can tell he put a lot of money, a lot of time, a lot of effort into this account. And even though he no longer enjoys the game anymore, he definitely enjoyed it a lot in the past. And I totally understand where he's coming from. Like if I were to quit Dokkan one day and you know, I no longer wanted my account, I wouldn't sell it. I would make sure to give it away to somebody else that, you know, still has that joy, still has that love for the game, just so I know that, like, my account is in good hands, that they're going to still continue to, uh, you know, get all the new free-to-play units, maybe summon for some new units and just keep building on it, because, you know, it would be really sad if the account was just left to die or ended up in the hands of someone who didn't really appreciate it, like, that would really suck. So uh, yeah, if I ever decided to quit the game, I would definitely do another video like this and give it away to one of you guys in the community. But of course, don't get too excited because I'm not quitting anytime soon. I still have a lot of love for the game, even though it does piss me off every once in a while. Uh, we're keeping the account. The channel is still going for the foreseeable future, okay? But uh, yeah, there you go. That is... The account right there uh, we're also going to take a look at some of the items just to see like how many you know orbs and training items all that stuff he has so uh, let's start with the trading items and we'll go down to the bottom here uh, yeah lots of Z swords lots and lots of platinum turtle shells and also quite a few of those caddy canes so you're good for training items here uh, let's see the training locations uh, yeah lots of times two gravity chambers and also uh, the 1.5 times gravity chambers for skill orbs. Um, it looks like he has a lot of really good skill orbs too. I see some uh, level 5 attacks, I see some level 4 attacks, uh, level 5 defense, some additionals, crits, uh, all of those good things. Let's go down to the bottom here for the gold skill orbs now. Uh, yeah, look at that, man. Level 4 additional. We got the additional and attack. It looks like he didn't use a ton of the Extreme Super Battle Road reward skill orbs that are, you know, some of the best in the game. Um, yeah, level 3 gold, additional gold crits. Yo, I wish I had these skill orbs on my account, man. I could use a bunch of these, but uh, yeah, good skill orbs too. And finally, let's, uh, oh, let's see how many stickers he has. Ooh, 10 unused stickers that can be used, obviously, on any unit you guys uh, choose. And potential orbs finally. Yo, that's so many. That's so many orbs. He's got enough orbs, I think, to rainbow like 10 to 20, I think, units of each type. Especially for tech, man. Look at all those tech orbs. Um, wow. Okay, so you won't have to worry about potential orbs on this account for a very long time, that's for sure. And uh, yeah, that does it for the account overview, guys. As, as I said in the beginning of this video, like it's a stacked account. It's everything you would want as either a newer player or a free-to-play player. I mean, realistically, this account would be an upgrade for like 95% of the Dokkan player base over their current account, right? So um, I think there's definitely going to be a lot of people that want this account. And before we talk about the contest details, I want to quickly put this disclaimer out there. Um, I know it might seem kind of obvious to you, but just to be safe, keep in mind, there's only one account, okay? And there's going to be probably a lot of entries. The selection process will be completely random, done by a program, so you definitely have a chance to win, but I would say keep your expectations under control, keep them fairly low, just so you're not disappointed if you don't win, okay? So with that out of the way, Let's talk about how you can enter. So the first thing you want to do is head down to my description and click on that first link and it will take you to a separate widget for the uh, contest. And once you get there, there will be four different ways to enter. Okay, the first way is by subscribing to my YouTube channel, which is the channel this video is on. That option is actually good for two entries. And then the second way to enter is by following me on Twitter at EatLikeGoku. That's another entry. The third way is by following my uh, Twitch channel at Tiger Uppercut Media, the same name as the YouTube channel. And the fourth and final way 
is by following me on Instagram at Tiger Uppercut Media. So in total, you can get up to five entries. Obviously, the more of them you do, the higher your chances are of winning. But of course, you only have to do one of them to get your name in there. And in terms of the contest length, it's going to run for just under a week starting now until uh, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on uh, Sunday, April 25th, at which time I'll do a random draw on the Gleam website and announce the winner on uh, my Twitter account. So make sure to follow me on Twitter if you want to have the most up-to-date uh, info about what's going on with the contest. And uh, once I select the winner, I'll email the account details, the transfer details to the email they provide when they enter the contest and uh, that person will be able to transfer the account over to their side and uh, you know call it their own so there you go guys that is everything you need to know about the contest good luck to everybody that enters shout out to mascan once again for providing the account you have approximately six days to enter get your name in there five different ways to enter and uh, the winner will be announced once again at 3 p.m eastern time on sunday april 25th so uh, once again good luck and uh, that's it guys thank you so much for watching today's video have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out